Good morning, it is Saturday the 29th of April and I've now got five days off work so I thought I would start another little vlog. Um, so I'm actually getting ready, I'm going out today with my grandma, we're going to go to Middlesbrough just for some lunch and to do some shopping. I'm really excited because I have a Lush there um, and I have not bought anything from Lush in the longest time ever um, and it's one of my favourite brands so I'm definitely going to be popping in there um so james is at work this weekend my mum and dad are away so yeah it's just gonna be nice for me and my grandma to have a little day out um so i do need to get a bit of the housework done i'm obviously just getting ready at the moment uh play with macy take her out for a walk and get her sorted before i go and um, we're only going to be a couple of hours and um, we're not going to stay long the weather's not very nice either so i'm wearing like a blue t-shirt some joggers i'm going to wear trainers my black like puffer coat um just cozy vibes because as i said the weather's not very nice also got my morning cup of tea however if you've watched one of my previous vlogs i've now become a little bit obsessed with iced coffee which is not something i ever thought i would say um i used to drink coffee every morning and now i drink tea every morning and ice drinks have just never been for me but iced coffee like coffee over ice has become a little favour of mine. Anyway, so I'm just getting ready now. Um, I'm just putting my foundation on like this because it's nearly empty, so I actually can't use the pump. Macy's got two new toys, haven't you? Ignore my table, but she's literally chewed. Um, and she's already got into this one, but I thought this would be good because there's no stuffing in it. And then this little guy here, whoa, um, also doesn't have any stuffing. Um, and then I've ordered you like another five, haven't I? She's just already destroyed most of her toys, so she would do a few upgrades. <laughs> And then I've also got this antler, so I'm just going to give her this for maybe like half an hour while I do some cleaning. Um, and then I'm going to take her for a walk, because she's never had one of these before. Um, she's had like horns and things, but she's never actually had an antler, so what's this? Ignore her like little gooey eye. What's that? I also don't know if she's hurt that paw. Like I know she's probably putting it up now because she wants the treat, but she keeps holding it up. Um, and I've looked and I can't see anything, but she's also not really like done anything to hurt it. Have you? Do you want it? She's like, is this for me? <laughs> Bye. honestly so tired from walking around um but yeah obviously had a look in a few shops i got a few bits um <laughs> hello 
Um, yeah, I've got a few bits that I will show you. Um, and we had some lunch out, which was really nice. We just like went to like a little pub and got a few like things to share, some like little bites or small bites they were called, and that was really nice. Um, I usually get like a toasty, not gonna lie. So having something a bit different, it felt a bit adventurous. Um, but yes, I've now got home, just let Macy out. She's now got her bone again, so well antler so she's very impressed with that and obviously Miley's been a bit clingy as you just saw okay so I'm going to show you what I got I am so glad that I took this shopping bag because it is so heavy the thing which I actually need to take downstairs is a little cake for James because I've got a bit of a tradition if I go out for food um I get James like a little cake or biscuit or something so next up is Lush now I actually really restrained myself in Lush I used to be obsessed as in all of my beauty products would be lush like shampoo conditioner makeup everything and um, went through a bit of a phase and i still absolutely love lush now but i do not buy as much as i used to and i got a lot of bath bombs from patisserie beauty and um, so i didn't want to get bath bombs because i've got so many to use up before i buy more so i treat myself to non-bath related products and um, so the first one is the cup of coffee face mask which i absolutely love recently got a frank body body scrub and that just made me want to get this face mask again absolutely love it this is what it looks like it's really textured and i love the smell of coffee it's only one of my favorite products they do so i've got the coffee face mask and then the other product i got was the jasmine and henna hair treatment so it's a bit of like a hair mask um i would use this like every week once a week before washing my hair um i used to have this years ago and i really loved it and because i've run out of my current hair mask i thought i would treat myself to it i would say like these lush products i mean lush generally is quite expensive now like let's be honest but for me it's worth it because with these products you only need a tiny bit and they will last a very long time and i just really love lush like bath bombs and stuff so um then i actually got a free face mask um i'm not sure why i think they were just giving some of them away and um, it, it does have like a little cross on it so um it's the bb seaweed fresh face mask so it does need to be kept in the fridge so i'm going to keep this one in the fridge this is what it looks like not my favorite scent but it's meant to be good for my skin type so we'll try it and then i got these two shower gels which i think are so cute and i will use them too but i just thought james would love them and obviously he didn't come with me today so i thought he would appreciate these how cute are those um luigi and mario shower gels um on wednesday just gone i didn't vlog because i just wanted to have a nice relaxed day uh, me and James actually, what did I do first? So I, so on Wednesday, um, just gone, I didn't vlog. Um, I actually went to Morrison's to do a bit of shopping and got some lunch there with my mum and grandma. Then me and James took Macy for a really big long walk around the park. And then afterwards, me and James had a little date night at the cinema um, and we went to see the new Mario film. I'm very picky when it comes to films, like really, really picky. And with it being like a cartoon, like a kid's film, I was a bit like really but i loved it don't tell james that but i actually really enjoyed it um so i thought these were really cute because obviously lush have a mario range out now they have a bath bomb i think it's a bath bomb it's massive it's literally so big it's yellow and um, it's like the question box i think and it's um 14 pound and i was gonna get him it but i thought 14 pound for a bath bomb when I've already got some bath bombs. So, so I thought these were really cute because um, I can use them too and they'll obviously last longer. And I think they were £8 each. So Luigi is a apple scent and the Mario is a sweetly spiced blend of lime, black pepper and pomegranate juice. So he will love those and they're really cool colours as well. So that's everything from Lush. Um, but I do really want to do another Lush order soon. Sticking with beauty, I have just ran out of my current shampoo and conditioner. And I actually got the L'Oreal Elviv Dream Length Heat Protection recently, which I really like. And Jess actually likes this range. So I thought I'm going to give it a go because obviously I have had my hair cut quite short recently um, to get all the dead ends off. So I've got the Restoring Shampoo. It was three for two in Superdrug. I got the Rapid Reviver Power Conditioner. They did have like the normal conditioner, but I thought I would get this one because it is two times more care for your hair um, and then i also got this which i have seen lots of great reviews about on social media it is the 
8 second wonder water which is like a a conditioner which I think you use before your conditioner and you just use a little bit on the ends so yeah I'm really looking forward to using those and I absolutely love like the colour and the packaging I think it looks pretty from Superdrug I got a headband it's just the Studio London range so it was literally only two pound um and it is like a velvet kind of like a dark olive colour and I just thought that was really cute because I use headbands when doing my skincare and makeup and I really love the pink one that I got from Sheen um but I just thought I'd pick that up while I seen it moving on to clothing just a few bits so this is obviously like an accessory um this is a little phone charm from New Look the one that I've got on my phone at the minute is New Look but it's getting a little bit grubby um so I thought I would get this it was $4.99 which I thought was really good it says vibes which might be a bit childish but I love the word vibe <laughs> um and it's just got really cute little bits on so it's got like a little watermelon and flowers and a lemon so I just thought that was really cute to put on my phone for spring and summer so from new look I got a pink top I absolutely love the shade of pink I think it suits me with my darker hair now as well um I actually already have this top in white and black this really pretty like edging along the bottom and the sleeves I got it in 16 because it is quite tight fitting so I did want it to be a tiny bit looser um so that was really cute um it was two for 14 pound but I just got the one it was nine pound um and I thought I'd get that because obviously I already like the style just really like that color I seen these jeans as well in new look these are the Tory uh short slim fit comfort stretch mom ankle grazers there's no rips in them Jess said that rips are out of fashion are they i don't know it's really difficult to find jeans that fit me i haven't even tried these on yet but i'm hoping they will fit because they're the same size as my other ones um so i liked those they're 30 pound but obviously jeans last a really long time so um yeah and i really like the color against the pink top i got then from premark i got a little pajama set these are my favorite pajamas to get they are literally only seven pound from premark um it's a t-shirt and trouser combo but they are honestly so comfortable um and it's also in their like care range so it's sustainable um the top is navy and then the bottoms are navy with cream shells i thought they would be quite nice for summer i'm probably going to start wearing them now to be honest um but then as i said my favorite type of pajamas other two things i got from premark was a t-shirt which is literally three pound um i got this in a large because it looked quite tight fitting um and it's just like a sporty logo type of top in a cream color um and i just thought that was really nice again for spring um and then i also got some joggers i currently have some gray joggers on which i absolutely love but they're a bit big for me and i got them in a large so i got these ones which um uh, slim leg well skinny fit and they are in a medium so we'll see how we go but there does look like there's lots of room in there um and they were just six pounds i did want some black joggers so i felt like i would pick them up while i spotted them also got one of the little pre-mark rediffusers for 80 pence this is wild berry and sweet jasmine and i thought the packaging was cute and obviously the rate pencil why not the last things i got was a few um, american sweets for james um so i got him this little s'mores thing um i got him a kool-aid in strawberry which is a bit crumpled from being in bag um i then got the now and later tropical punch i think you get a six um and then i also got him a laffy taffy in blue raspberry so he just really likes kind of novelty things, if you can't tell. <laughs> but he also likes um, like American candy and stuff. So I just thought I would get him some bits because obviously I've bought myself quite a lot, let's be honest. Um, so yeah, that's my little haul. And as I said, now I'm just going to have a chilled evening. I probably won't vlog much more today because obviously this is day one of five days off and my last two vlogs that i've edited and uploaded to youtube have been over 50 minutes long they were just over the course of four days so yeah i'm not gonna film too much more today this will probably be the last thing um that i include in today's part of the vlog but i've just noticed that there is new episodes of firefly lane um very bittersweet because i think this is the last season and i know that it is quite sad um but i absolutely love watching it so i think for the rest of the evening i'm probably just going to binge watch this okay so it is now sunday i've just washed my hair with all of the products that i got yesterday um, and also used the lush hair treatment which honestly like just the smell was just so nostalgic um but yeah so my hair is feeling 
very nice and refreshed. I'm just gonna dry it a little bit. Um, just give Macy her breakfast and then I'm gonna let her out. Um, I've just quickly done my skincare as well. I've just got toothpaste in my mouth. Um, today I'm actually going to my grandma and granddad's house for Sunday dinner with obviously my mum and dad being away and James being at work. Um, so I'm excited about that. But other than that, I think I'm just gonna have like a really nice chill day. I'm gonna get a lot of like editing and like content planned and scheduled and blog posts written and stuff like that. Um, it's quite dull outside it's been raining here's Marnie coming to say hello as usual um but James is actually off Monday Tuesday so I think if I'm gonna actually sit down and film any um like haul videos or if I'm gonna do any kind of like reels or anything I'll probably wait till Monday Tuesday when it's hopefully a bit brighter outside and when I've got the time to go upstairs like for a few hours but obviously at the minute I'm trying to look after Macy while doing everything else so yeah that's the plan anyway um and i'm probably gonna watch a lot more of firefly lane so so i've just made myself some porridge um and i'm just gonna start editing some thumbnails so i'm just getting ready to go to my grandma and granddad's for dinner um and i thought i'd put a little bit of makeup on before i go um it's about half one now and so far today i've done a little bit of housework um edited a few videos um and just chilled really it's a horrible day outside it is raining and just like really dull like it looked quite bright here in the office but yeah it's just not a very nice day um macy doesn't even want to go out like i open the door for her normally she likes to just be in the garden for ages just like sniffing and probably trying to eat things she shouldn't um and she honestly just doesn't even want to go out and it's probably because of the rain um but yeah she's just currently curled up on the sofa um which is a bit cute really so yeah i'm just gonna get ready um i'm quite excited for my dinner actually and i've totally forgot to put concealer over that mess on my face um but normally my mum makes my sunday dinner and obviously she is away so i've not had a meal at my grandma and granddad's for such a long time so that'd be nice Also, just before I go, I feel like my hair actually looks really like shiny and healthy and it feels a lot like smoother. So yeah, would definitely recommend the hair care products that I mentioned yesterday. Some drawers upstairs. Um, Macy, it's slightly fuming that she's got her coat on. Aren't you darling? But it's raining. So I've just been sat at the table writing a blog post. I've also just posted an Instagram reel. Um, I took Macy for a walk. She was fuming that I put her coat on. Um, and I've just been chilling really. Um, I'm just about to go to my mum and dad's because Jess is home. Um, and we're going to have a movie night. And she said she's going to do chocolate covered strawberries. So looking forward to that. This is the blog post that I've been doing, um, which was about last weekend um, when I went to like the museum and for food um, and the farm that did milkshakes and then of course some cookies from Sip and Sugar. So if you didn't watch that vlog, it was just a little weekend vlog, um, but I really enjoyed it and I've decided to write a little blog post on it too. So it's now Monday, do excuse those wispy bits of hair. Um, I've just put on the cup of coffee lush face mask. Um, so I'm just having a bit of a pamper morning. Um, as I said about the hair treatment, like the smell is just so nostalgic because I used to buy them so often. Um, and I can actually still smell the hair treatment in my hair. So like through the day, I just get like a little scent of it and I'm like, 
it just feels nice like i've not obviously bought lush in a while so yeah i'm just gonna let this do its magic and hopefully make me look a little bit more awake because i'm really tired this morning um last night jess was watching scream i don't know which one it was um i'm such a wuss so even that scared me um and we were playing bingo on our phone because she was gonna go and actually play bingo but we just didn't know what time like it would start and things um Miley's just trying to get my attention so we were playing it on our phone and i didn't win anything so Never mind. Um, I don't know what the plan is for today. James is off today and tomorrow. So we might get up to something. Um, obviously, if so, I will show you. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to make myself a cup of tea, feed the pets and then clean this off. Oh, and I might be going to the gym um, and swimming um, like late morning time. So hopefully going to get that out of the way again. <laughs> So I've just got back from the gym Um, we went to the gym and then went swimming Um, I've just put on a little bit of makeup and got dressed because we thought we would head into town as they've got like a food market on at the moment so we thought we'd get dinner there um, and then we need to pick my mum and dad up from town anyway because they're coming home from their trip Um, so yeah I'm in a rush so I'm gonna go if I get anything to eat I will show you what I get <laughs> I'm now back and um, we had some really nice food in the market um, and then obviously picked my mum and dad up we went back to theirs and um, because they had some little gifts for us and then I've come back and um, James has just went out with his friends so I thought I would take the opportunity to come up into the office and have a bit of a tidy up I've left Macy downstairs with a lick mat and a bone so I'm hoping that she will entertain herself um, because the office has become a bit of a mess. Um, obviously, I create content in here. I do my skincare and makeup. I plan with like stickers. Um, so yeah, there's always a lot going on in here. So it does very easily become a little bit cluttered. So yeah, I'm just going to take some time and clean in here. Um, and then me and my mum are going to go food shopping. Um, about tea time just because we're normally gone a weekend but obviously she's been away so I'm gonna go probably to Lidl and get a few bits then. I'm keep it real and show you just how messy it is because I feel like I definitely didn't do it justice showing you on the camera there. Yeah bit of a mess. Um, so this is the before. I might show you a little bit of cleaning but you will then see the after. Still got a lot to do, but this is the progress. Um, I've mainly sorted out all of this. So I was just going to clean up so that it was tidy, but I've actually went through um, this section, which had like loads of candles and stuff, um, which I've minimised down. I've went through my candle box, which was actually full, mainly of wax melts, but I think they've gone off because I've had them such a long time. Um, and then cleaned down here. This needs to be sorted through, but I've put all of like my planning stuff stuff and that's like my apple watch box um and then i've went through and sorted my everyday skincare everyday makeup and then other bits of makeup that i sometimes use but not specifically every day and some other like products that i've just used recently um i can't get this little thing off which is annoying me but i'm gonna ask james to do that when he gets home because that's a little reed diffuser i got from premark um this is actually something i've just been recently sent um a tanning mousse which i haven't tried yet i might try it tonight um because i'm going to try and get content for it tomorrow so obviously if i've tried it then i can give a better review um and that's a little card it came with um this is some skincare that i'm posting on my instagram tonight so i've kept them out um, with the boxes just so that if I want to I can reach for the box and have a look to see what it says because this one for example has some like, little benefits of what's inside of it and um, so I just thought I'd keep them out for when I do my little pour so that's how it's going I also really want kind of like a little tub or something to put um 
like content props so for example this is just some silk which i only use really for like flat layers um and then i've got like the mirror that's over here which i use and there is a few other bits floating around somewhere um so i think i'm gonna change these boxes because i just don't really like them that much anymore um i do want to have some kind of pattern so i might get maybe like a little basket or something um either white or clear um because i just yeah i don't really like them anymore um but obviously i do still want like some kind of storage because i've got loads of skincare bits in there loads of makeup in here um so i do need obviously storage to kind of hide everything away so ready these are my crackers for dinner so obviously they probably don't interest you but i've got you some crepes and have you ever had these before I used to get these all the time, so my mum used to get me and dress them. It's like literally, obviously, an ice cream corn, and it's got marshmallow and sprinkles in it. So I thought you'd like them. The fact that I used to eat them all the time, like, now it just makes my mouth feel dry, to be honest. And I got you some popcorn. Pepsi Max, got you some of these. Um, and then I've got chicken for the fajitas. Um, and then I got a Summer World lasagna and got you a <laughs> cheap version. <laughs> but you've still got some ready meals in the freezer. Um, and then I've got myself meatballs and pasta and then a sausage rice situation in there. Um, I've got some flowers. Um, and then I've got myself these. You can have some though. Right. and then i've got um fudges twirls and freddles for the little chocolate bars and then i've got you these yogurts because i've still got some of them other ones left but i don't mind these ones if you want to share i've got some strawberries and cheese milk orange juice washing stuff this was three pound half price and uh, so i've got that very fruity bin bags and then i've got peppers and onions for the oh and the sour cream and chai for the fajitas and then i've got tuna and sweet corn and lettuce and that is my little haul i know what i'm doing you do realize this could start a war between king kings of battle and elfweird inherits a land free of the human curse Time is running out for my bloodline. Could you not just wield influence another way? Build it. Oh, I am in my somewhat tidier office. Um, just about to play GTA with James. I've got some Pepsi Max, some biscuits, and the Xbox controller. So I've literally not played games in ages. I normally play Sims if anything. Um, never mind GTA, but yeah, um, just gonna sit and play that for a while. Um, as you'll have saw, we had tea and I was watching, I think it's Vikings, it's whatever James is watching anyway. I <laughs> so watched that, um, and before that, we obviously went shopping and grabbed a few bits. So, yeah, just gonna chill and then go to bed. And tomorrow, we're going to IKEA, so I'm very excited about that. Um, but yeah, so I am now gonna play i'm gonna oh my god i'm gonna show you my <laughs> gta character from ages ago i'll turn the camera around um not sure where i was going with this but obviously that definitely doesn't look like me so it's now Tuesday. I've just been taking some content in the office for Instagram and TikTok. Um, and I'm not going to lie, I've made such a mess. Like all of the cleaning and tidying that I did yesterday, you just wouldn't even think I'd bothered to do. So I'm just going to get dressed. Um, I think I'm going to have to straighten my hair a bit because like all of the ends of my hair is just like sticking up. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get ready and then we're going to take Macy for a walk. I'm going to try and really quickly tidy the office a little bit before we go because I'm getting some drawers from my Ikea for the office um so obviously I need it as clean as possible because I'm gonna have to put these drawers together um yes yeah, so that's the plan um I'll probably show you around Ikea I've not been in such a long time so I'm very excited um but it's also very tempting to buy everything so I'm gonna have to really restrain myself and I think we might get something to eat and drink while we're out um and yeah I'll just show you what I get up to
I am honestly like frazzled, so tired. Um, on the way there, we literally were doing like circles trying to find how to get into like the IKEA car park because the maps kept taking us to, um, you know, like the trade entrance and things. I'm just gonna like mercy out, um, which obviously wasn't ideal. So that took ages. Anyway, so yeah, got to IKEA, had a look around, had some food, had the meatballs for the first time ever. It was actually really good. Um, got the drawers for me and Jess. Then we went to Starbucks and I got the, is it? mango and passion fruit oh no is it dragon fruit i can't remember now i think it's dragon fruit um refresher and it was so nice they shouldn't have actually given me it because i think you have to have the app um but the girl was really nice and was like have you got the app say yes <laughs> um so i got it and yeah it was really nice like i'm really picky with drinks um because i often find things like a bit sickly um but i really like the refreshers from starbucks and that's definitely like the best one i've had so far so that was nice got a um crispy cream donut to bring home and so i'm gonna have that later um but yeah i think i'm just gonna try and get a bit of tidying up done uh, we're gonna go and take Macy for a walk after and also make the heaters. So I'm now in my comfy clothes. I've just been cleaning. I've brought the boxes up, um, which have all of the bits for the drawers in upstairs. I don't know if I'm gonna do that later or tomorrow because I am quite tired, but I'm about to make our tea and um, we're having fajitas and I actually got gifted the box, like the fajita making kit. Um, so yeah, just as a little <laughs> FYI that it's gifted, bit strange, not my usual gifted content, but I'm all for it because obviously I do love food and I love heaters. So I'm going to make that um, and I will show you what it looks like um, and then we'll probably watch TV while we eat and then take Macy for a walk. We have visitors. Right, I'm going to tackle trying to put these up. However, Jess has it and it took my dad an hour and a half i think so not hopeful uh, the cats are heavily invested in <laughs> the flat pack situation and i am totally regretting it because it just seems a lot harder than i imagined so that's fun what are you doing <laughs> they keep chasing each other around and obviously sitting on the box so is can have it when I'm done, which might be five to seven working days. <laughs> this was a better idea in my head. I think if she had a ball or something to like go and fetch, she probably wouldn't be as bothered. But obviously, at the minute. <laughs> Go play then. <laughs> yeah, you just run around and she'll chase you. Oh God, oh God. <laughs> Slow down. Morning, there's Miley. Um, it's now Wednesday, so it is the last day of this vlog. Um, I've not really got anything planned. I obviously want to put the drawers up from Ikea because I didn't make any progress last night. Um, and I want to get some more content done. But other than that, I've got nothing planned. So we'll just see what I get up to. Literally, Miley is nudging my arm. Um, Miley, uh, James is off today, but he's doing training. So he's currently in the bedroom on his uh, on my laptop. Um, and I think, <laughs> Miley, he might move around the house. So at the minute, I've got everywhere that I can be apart from the bedroom. Because um, he's out like, on team, so he's out like, on video and stuff. Um, so I'm making a cup of tea. And I'm gonna make him some porridge um, and then probably just gonna go and make a start on the drawers, which I am really not looking forward to. Some paving. Oh, oh sorry, did I scare you? Oh, I'm sorry. I've been taking photos of skincare and stuff, so she's obviously been a bit scared of like the spraying sounds. But you're just having a little sunbath, aren't you? This is the situation of the drawers. Um, nowhere near done, but at least making progress because all I did last night was literally get them up box <laughs> and that was enough. So oh, this is how we're looking. And they are gonna go and step over. This is where they're gonna go. So at the minute, 
ignore the pile of stuff just that I've been moving around. But it's literally just like bags and wrapping paper and stuff, which I think I'll probably still keep there, um, like down the side, which you won't obviously be able to see because it'll be um, kind of hidden by the drawers. But that's where it's going to go. So I'm just getting ready to go out. I literally like I'm squinting because it is so bright outside. Um, so my mum and grandma are going to Sainsbury's and they asked if I wanted to go. I don't need anything. I don't really need to go. But I can never say no. Couldn't refuse. I'm really loud playing outside. Um, so I'm going to go there. I just really like looking at all of like the homeware stuff and the clothes. Like I really like the fashion that Sainsbury's do actually. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to tag along. I've been getting a bit of content this morning. So doing some like little reels for skincare. Um, and I'm really happy with what I've got actually because I did some yesterday and when I went to edit them, I just wasn't feeling it. Like I just didn't like it. Um, so I'm really glad obviously that I got some good shots. I'm just gonna do a bit of skincare. I got these products sent to me from the Joba Joba company, which you may have seen me mention already. Um, but yeah, I'm really enjoying them. And actually this looks so good in the sunlight. I wonder if I should, before I go try and get a little reel of it. I'm excited to get my drawers up because they're going to go in the corner next to my desk um, and once they're up it's just like another area for me to get content obviously there's lots of storage as well so I'm going to put like um, handbags and hair clips and jewellery and stuff in because I have obviously all of my clothes and accessories like normally in the bedroom Um, it's not going to be like a dressing room because obviously I've got my desk and you know I do my content in here and planning and gaming and stuff like that Um, obviously there's no space for like a wardrobe or anything but um, I would like to have my accessories in there like my little handbags and like I said hair clips and things so that when I've got dressed in my bedroom I can then come in here because I've started to do my skincare makeup stood in the office um, and then obviously I can go over to that area and put some jewellery on and like yeah pick a handbag and stuff so um and like I said it will also be like another surface area for taking content um just to change things up a bit really so I'm looking forward to that I don't know what to use now and the little top that I got from Prima and these jeans again from New Look and this is how the drawers are looking at the minute so I'm definitely making progress wonder where Miley is. Oh, they're going to be sad when this actually gets put up and they can't just run and hide in it. Hi. So it's just turned six o'clock. Um, I've really focused today on getting content for Instagram and TikTok and I'm really happy with what I've got and um, so I've got loads of posts planned and um, for the rest of this evening I'm going to have tea at my mum and dad's I think they're having spaghetti bolognese uh, my dad's going to come here and help me finish the drawers because I have accepted defeat um, and then other than that I'm going to maybe watch some Firefly Lane because James has gone to the cinema with his brother so obviously um, I've got time to just sit and watch that but also I do want to write some blog posts and kind of like plan all of the content that I got today as well um so yeah I'm not going to probably end the vlog here but I will say goodbye here because um I'll probably forget to end it otherwise um so thank you for watching especially if you've watched this file have to let me know because I feel like I've just rambled on so much and part of me always thinks like who actually wants to watch little old me and my boring life but I mean I do think I've actually done a bit more recently like you know going to Ikea and Starbucks and like the museum last week and stuff like I think I've actually um you know been pushing myself to actually go out especially with James it's been nice to do things with him um but I always remember watching one of Emma from Bringing Mummy of Tea's videos and she said about starting vlogging and she said just do it because the chances are there is at least one person in the world that's just Miss with a born that will watch it and enjoy it and it'll be their kind of thing um, and I always really like to watch vlogs myself so yeah um, obviously for me putting them together as well like I always like watching them back and um, a few weeks ago I sat and watched my old like vlogmas videos from a couple of years ago and it's just nice to like 
see the memories and like especially like people obviously i mean i've literally got a thousand subscribers i'm not like so well or anything but um you know knowing that she can like watch all of her videos back and now that she's got a child and like that child will be able to watch her mum's life like on youtube assuming that youtube's around then i just think that's amazing so yeah bit of a <laughs> random ramble there but yeah thank you for watching okay the plan for next weekend so i'm thinking on the saturday i'm gonna sit and film some sit down videos so like a favorites video and um, some beauty hauls things like that the sunday me and james are going to windermere so i'm gonna do a travel vlog like i might literally just do a vlog based on that day if there's enough footage because um it's the first time me and james will have gone on like a little day bus trip um and i kind of feel like that even though we're not going on holiday and it is literally in the uk and it's just for probably like a few hours um i really want like just travel content to be separate um years ago i tried to do um like vlogs when i'd go on holiday and i would literally film everything and then like a few months later i'd just delete them because i'd be like no i'm not gonna do that and i kind of wish that i had because i'd love to watch them when he's back yes that's saturday and sunday and then i've also got the monday tuesday wednesday off so i'll probably just do a normal kind of homey little you know lifestyle kind of vlog then so that's what's to come um but yeah as i said thank you for watching if you've got this far sorry for rambling so much So the drawers are up. Um, I actually, well, my dad realised that I had put these white bits on the wrong way, but luckily um, it hasn't messed it up. I haven't actually cleaned the space that they're going to go in, so it's just going to stay here probably till um, Friday night or Saturday. But this is what the top looks like. So obviously it's got the mirror um, and this is a part which will have jewellery in. Um, we've got like two smaller drawers. I probably should have put the light on. Um, and then we've got four bigger drawers. So I think these ones are going to be like accessories. Um, and then the other four are going to be a mix between handbags and then like random beauty things. 